Yeah, and guys, it is that time of the year. One of the great shows is back on our tellies. One person in particular who is coming back as an all-star this year. Someone you might remember from the uh, early 2000s. Get around it. Harding from Australian Idol fame of, I believe, 2005. He was, and probably still to this day is, the biggest crush I have ever had. Really? No way. Now, I've been really excited to watch this season of The Voice purely for my nostalgia of Lee Harding. I've been excited to hear he's coming back. So I tuned in last night and I'm, I'm ready to go. And at the start, they had a promo that's kind of looking ahead to the season. And I nearly fell off my chair. My ex-boyfriend's on it. Oh, <laughs> what? No. And real life ex-boyfriend, not Lee Harding, who I would like to have yeah, not called dream my boyfriend. boyfriend. And not a Bachelorette contestant. And not a Bachelorette contestant. An actual. In fact, a former The Voice contestant. His name is Matthew Garwood. Um, people might remember him as the tattooed... Opera singer. You like the bad boys. <laughs> the well, tattooed hey, opera okay. singer. That's the best slash right. worst description I've ever so heard. So this show is perfect for him, right? Oh, wow. So he's got this beautiful classical voice. So when he was on the show a few years ago, he sang a song from the Phantom of the Opera. So um, now this was years ago that I dated him, many years ago. So I am right, curious that my watching of this show to live my nostalgia of when I was 16 and loved yes. Lee Harding has been ruined by my <laughs> bloody ex-boyfriend. So, you, so you, you can't watch it? I mean, you've No, got, I can't watch it. They've got... Uh, do, uh, do they look similar? Are they similar? I mean, they've well, got similarities. Like, okay, so if anyone knows what my boyfriend, who's also named Lee, but my boyfriend now looks like, they would a- assume that's my type. He's very good looking, like athletic, beautiful man. But, I mean, he's very, very hot. Yeah. He's he good is. Man. But now people are going to think my type yeah. is weird emo e- punk emo, emo, from the 2000s. <laughs> emo coloured colored tipped hair with sweatbands. I mean, so, I can see it. Well, we all go I through phases. Can remind everyone that I have grown? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Heidi, Xavier and Ryan. Weekdays from 6. Hit 92.9.